Hi guys, my name is Albert Tan. I'm the founder of DownloadSilo.com. Welcome back to our another session of Lifetime Deal Review. As digital marketers, sometimes you need to convert your blog post or articles into speech and embed it at your website. Maybe at some point of time, you want to churn out a quick video, but you do not want to record your own voice. Or you want to start a podcast to be distributed to Apple, Google or Spotify one day. Lastly, you may want to create an audio book from an article you have written. How can you do all these four things easily and effortlessly? Today, this is what I'm going to review a new app called Audio. Let's get started now. Let me go to the screen uh, for this uh, audio. Okay, let me share my screen. This is audio review, uh, what I call a, a review that I've written in this brief and I will follow, follow this flow. So everybody knows that, you know, uh, text to speech as well as a uh, podcast maker, audio creator and text to video can be very difficult to do if you do not know how to use it with the correct tool. So what is uh, audio actually? Let's move on. So it is advertised as the simplest way to create voiceover, video, podcast, and audiobooks. So audiobook, uh, audio is actually a tool that can help you uh, create this video and audio using human-like uh, voices that is using AI technologies uh, with the most simplified uh, workflow. This is what they are doing. So I have actually uh, gone through this uh, audiobook, uh, not audiobook, the, this audio app uh, in great detail. And we actually have done a, what they call Facebook Live with the founder as well. So let's get, get back to our previous uh, giveaway and also official discussion track. This is in our Facebook. And we have actually done a, a Facebook live session here. But of course, uh, during the Facebook live session, we have answered most of the question. But today, I'm going to do a, a detailed review of this audio. And that's why you are here. So let's get back to this uh, audio review. And what are the impressions that I have you know, uh, for this uh, audio? And I would say that, you know, audio is actually a very uh, super clean and uh, very minimalistic uh, design in terms of user interface as well as a uh, user experience. So the website and the web uh, dashboard backend is uh, very similar to Writer, for which uh, because they share one of the co-founder, this is uh, Mr. Atu. So that's why you can uh, experience that, you know, uh, Writers as well as uh, audio is actually very similar in terms of uh, website design and their backend design. So for audio, other than what I call this uh, uh, text to speech, they can actually also create you know a text to video, uh, podcast as well as audio books. So they have uh, four what I call major uh, functions. So these are the major functions: uh, text to speech, text to video, and podcast maker as well as uh, audio book creator. So what comes with the voices, you know, we are talking about AI technology, what are the voices they have, you know, they come with more than, more than 600 and 650 voices, you know, 65 plus uh, languages and 100 plus uh, dialects, you know. So for the details, you can actually go to the website, and check it out. And the engines, the AI engines are actually from Google, uh, Azure, Amazon, and soon they will also incorporate uh, IBM Watson. So this is their old screenshot, you know, that uh, they have 640, but actually now they have more than 650 voices, 65 languages, and more than 100 uh, dialects. So very briefly, uh, let me tell you what I like about this uh, audio. So I, I, I would say that, you no, know, it's very simple, uh, super easy to use uh, because they are at once editor. I will go on to that later. And you can actually uh, insert multiple voices in one script. For example, you are doing a, a what they call a voiceover. You can have multiple voices. Could be a one man, one girl, or maybe a different person. Maybe up to ten person, as many as you can. 
uh, in terms of uh, voices. So I would say that you know uh, you can also create and host unlimited podcast show as well as audio books. So I repeat, unlimited. So the only limit is actually the credit that you have in your lifetime deal. So you can also embed your what I call uh, audio player in your website, and more than that, you can also uh, what I call uh, turn up public pages for your podcast and audio books. You know, there's no need to host anything in your website. There's no plugin to worry about. You know, they are actually hosting it. So I will show you later how does it look like. So, but if you prefer to host your voice over uh, podcast or audio book in your own website. This is uh, easily achievable through this uh, iframe embedding. So let's move on to the uh, what they call the details in the backend. So I've come to this. Uh, this is their backend. As you can see, it's very simple and also minimalistic. You know, uh, they have actually four uh, main uh, what they call menu here. This is a strip editor. This is where you collect uh, you know, create your text to video. This is where you create your podcast. This is where you could, uh, you can create your audio books. So basically, uh, we start with script uh, editor. You know? So I have done some testing. Actually, this is uh, some of the testing. Maybe I do one more round uh, regarding the testing. Let's say I want to create a new script. So testing. Okay, let's create the script. Okay, you can see that from here, uh, this is the person's uh, voice. Oh, they have many voices. When you click the the name Sarah, you have a different kind of a uh, dialect or languages that you have. You know, so you can have Chinese, you can have English, you can have Filipino. You even have uh, Hindi, Hebrew, many languages. So, but for the sake of uh, today demonstration, uh, we will talk about, about using English, you know, so that more people can understand. So, Sarah is the voice of an American uh, lady. So, if you want to filter whether it's a male or female, you can click here. So, you can male, you can click here. So, let's uh, maybe we should put back uh, female. We put back Sarah, you know, Sarah. Okay, this is the place where you put your text and after putting your text in, you will be able to, uh, the system will actually will be able to create the, the voice over. So let me get some, uh, what I call some text for my website. So let me see where should I get, okay. Maybe we should uh, get the text, you know, what is lifetime due? Okay, let me copy here hold on let me copy here control c go back to the script the editor and we paste it there okay so the moment you paste it there uh, you will see that they have different section uh, automatically uh, created for you so basically, you don't have to worry, you know, uh, how to what they call uh, do the different section in this editor. This is for the sake of easy management, you know. And I was told that you know, uh, in one section or maybe you call it one paragraph here, you can consist up to two thousand characters, which means about three hundred to four hundred words. Okay, so these are the text that we have pasted just now, but then is a uh, easily uh, what they call a. Uh, put in different section for you to manage it. So you can always uh, hear the voice now. Let me uh, click here so that you can hear the voice now. What is a lifetime deal? In layman terms, lifetime deals are massive discounts on apps, software, tools, or any resources where you only pay one-time fee to get to use them for life. A SaaS lifetime deal is when a SaaS does a limited time promotion offering a lifetime access for a certain fixed price. The promotion is normally run in a fixed duration of time. So this is the last paragraph. Let me click the play. 
Once you buy and redeem a SaaS lifetime deal, you have access to that software for the lifetime of the product. Obviously not the lifetime of the buyer. Of course, not the lifetime of the buyer, you know, just remember that. So uh, before we move to the next, uh, what I call, sesh, uh, next uh, section on this video, text to video, I want to, uh, what I call, uh, show you how to do some uh, magic here. So once you have actually uh, satisfied with the voice, you can actually play the, the whole thing here. Okay, let's play the whole thing and see how is the voice like and also whether is it sounds like human or not. What is, what a, is lifetime a lifetime deal? deal? In layman terms, lifetime deals are massive discounts on apps, software, tools, or any resources where you only pay one-time fee to get to use them for life. A SaaS lifetime deal is when a SaaS does a limited-time promotion offering a lifetime access for a certain fixed price. The promotion is normally run in a fixed duration of time. Once you buy and redeem a SaaS lifetime deal, you have access to that software for the lifetime of the product. Obviously not the lifetime of the buyer. Okay, that is uh, what I call uh, generated by this uh, AI technology. So if you're happy with it, you can just click the download button and save it to your computer. Okay, and just for the sake of a demo, I will actually can change the voice of uh, this, uh, maybe this lady. Maybe now uh, I want this, uh, this guy to, to talk about it. Uh, let's say maybe the, gay, the male guy. Maybe Brandon. <clears throat> okay, you can see that, you know, this is the Brandon's voice. Then uh, maybe we leave it as Sarah here. Maybe we say that, you know, uh, for the next paragraph, we put Brandon as well. Okay, then there are four sections here. Uh, two sections is by Sarah. Uh, two sections is by Brandon. And just hear what is, uh, how is the voice of this Brandon? What is a lifetime deal? A SaaS lifetime deal is when a SaaS does a limited time promotion offering a lifetime access for a certain fixed price. The promotion is normally run in a fixed duration of time. Okay, looks good. Let's hear the whole conversation or maybe the whole, whole uh, paragraph. Let's what play is now. A lifetime deal? In layman terms, lifetime deals are massive discounts on apps, software, tools, or any resources where you only pay one-time fee to get to use them for life. A SaaS lifetime deal is when a SaaS does a limited-time promotion offering a lifetime access for a certain fixed price. The promotion is normally run in a fixed duration of time. Once you buy and redeem a SaaS lifetime deal, you have access to that software for the lifetime of the product. Obviously not the lifetime of the buyer. Okay, this demo is actually perfect. You know? So while we are in this uh, script editor, we can actually uh, tell you some of the additional thing that you can do with it. Okay, let me show you. First is the background music. So for example, you want to have a soft background music, you can actually upload it if you want to. So you can control the volume. You know? So we can adjust the script. So obviously you have to choose your own file you know, uh, from your computer. So we are not going to upload anything because it will take up a lot of times. And the second thing is the pronunciation map, you know. So pronunciation map actually is something like, you know, uh, for example, you are teaching somebody, uh, teaching the, what they call the AI uh, background. No, the AI uh, technology that, you know, certain words must be pronounced as certain uh, what they call a certain way. For example, audio. This is the brand name of audio. So you want to want it to be uh, pronounce it as audio. Okay. So let's uh, for example, actually they have actually teach them you know <laughs> audio. 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 Okay. So this is the way. How do you how do you uh, teach the what they call this AI uh, to pronounce the word that as you want, you no? Know, rather than uh, what they call something that is uh, by their own. So this is very useful if you have a special uh, what they call pronunciation uh, to be done. It's all done here, and you can actually test the uh, 
voice of different person as well here. Okay, let's uh, go back. This is the two function, background music as well as pronunciation uh, voice. You can do a few more things here because uh, for the script uh, editor here, click the three dot and you can actually change the voice, uh, what you call, let me, okay, you can upload an audio file as well, which means, for example, you have pre-recorded certain uh, uh, maybe voice, uh, not actually generated by AI, but you can, uh, it's a human voice, you can actually upload it, no? it's just uh, what you call uh, uh, additional features, no? you can download it and you can also delete it, you can also change the voice. Change the voice mean change the person who is speaking, you know. So this is easily done here. Click the three dot here. And how do you change the what they call uh, the intonation as well as the emphasis of the of the voice uh, that is uh, generated by AI? Uh, actually, it's quite simple. You can actually you know just click here, just uh, highlight certain what they call word or maybe paragraph. Uh, then you actually can adjust it accordingly. For example, we want to what they call uh, do a what they call emphasis on these three words. We just click the emphasize uh, what they call menu. You have a strong emphasis, moderate emphasis, or reduce emphasis. Let's for example we put a strong emphasis and see what is the uh, okay. Let me click it properly. Strong emphasis. And play it again. In layman terms, lifetime deals are massive discounts on apps, software, tools, or any resources where you only pay one time fee to get to use them for life. Okay, maybe for example, we want to uh, do some other changes. Maybe lifetime deal, we want to tune, make it uh, the pitch higher. Means the extra high, extra low. These are the what it calls four or five uh, what they call pitch that you can choose from, and the rate of uh, what they call the voice uh, talking about these uh, words. So the rate can be slow, uh, slow, extra slow, medium, fast, uh, extra fast. If not, then will be the medium that uh, will be the default. And you do, you can actually uh, play around with it, you no, know, to suit your own case. Okay, let's say. Maybe we just say that, you know, just for the demo purpose, we can just uh, adjust the, the rate, you know, make it slow. Maybe we can say so. Okay, then we just play around and see how it sounds like. In layman terms, lifetime deals are massive discounts on apps, software, tools or any resources where you only pay one time fee to get to use them for life. So you can see that, you know, uh, the few words here, we actually make it very slow. So we can actually, you know, uh, manipulate the, the rate, whether is it the pitch to make it the uh, high pitch or low pitch, or maybe the speed, extra slow or extra fast. So if you do not want, uh, you can just clear it, then it will become the normal default. Okay, so this is a way on how to actually uh, adjust the intonation, you know, the pitch, the rate, you know, of the speech. And there's one, uh, what I call a uh, uh, thing that some people will actually uh, use it, you know, uh, when they actually talk about certain thing in the public. This is called pause, you know, for example, okay, let me say that there's two paragraph here, two paragraph. So I want to pause it. After this paragraph, I can adjust the time of pause. Maybe one second, maybe two seconds is up to you. So let's play around. Maybe I just put 0 0.5 second, you know. Okay, let's put uh, 0 0.5 second. And we play now. Just play the whole thing. A SaaS lifetime deal is when a SaaS does a limited time promotion offering a lifetime access for a certain fixed price. The promotion is normally run in a fixed duration of time. So you can hear that, you know, after the first sentence, uh, actually there's a small pause of 0.5 seconds. 
but you have to uh, what they call experiment it you know to see how the effects like on, on your text so i would actually normally do about half a second pause or maybe maximum uh, one second pause uh, unless you want to make it a very dramatic you know you can pause it for maybe two seconds you know that kind of thing so these are the features that you know you can adjust uh, in the text so this is pronounced a SaaS lifetime deal is when a SaaS does a limited time promotion offering a lifetime access for a certain fixed price. The promotion is normally run in a fixed duration of time. Okay, this pronounce actually is just uh, say out the words, you know, uh, and it is, you know, so you to see that, you know, whether this is what you want. Okay, that's it, you know, this is the script editor and this is the basis of how to turn text to speech in this uh, audio uh, backend. And this is the core, what they call uh, engine, you know, uh, over uh, this uh, audio uh, app. So next we would like to go into this second, uh, what they call uh, area that is text to video. After that, we will move on to this uh, podcast maker as well as uh, audio book creator. So let's move on. Just my screen. Okay. Video. So they share the same, uh, what I call a uh, menu here. I mean, the same master menu here. So you have three menus, uh, four menus, script, video, podcast, and also audiobook. So these are the, what I call this uh, video that I have created, you no, know, uh, using this uh, text to video. And actually, this is not a, what I call uh, full flash kind of text to video uh, where you actually put in the text and they will choose the what I call uh, photos or images you know uh, directly no this is not going to do that they are actually you know uh, text to speech uh, engine they are not actually you know video editor that kind of thing so you still have to upload your video or as or your your photo so that they turn it into a text to speech uh, video let me show you how how uh, what you call the outcome like let me uh, this is what i've already done you know uh, what are the three use cases of audio and then first one is american voice and the second one is the indian voice you now let's do it now and actually i have actually uh what i call created this uh what you call in the back end so i'm not going to repeat it again so there are a few ways to view the video this is actually uh, preview it the other way is actually you can download it after you have done it you know after doing the editing okay let's uh, preview this one first hi my name is sarah today i am going to talk about what are the use cases of audio a new app which uses AI-powered text-to-speech engines developed by industry leaders like Google, Microsoft, and Amazon. Audio is a tool that helps you create video and audio content using human-like voices with the most simplified workflow. First let me talk about creating a podcast within minutes by using audio. Podcasts is the new buzz all around the town, although it's not that new of a medium. And some would argue they're not new at all. But in the past few years, we've seen them created and downloaded at record rates. A whopping 4.5 million podcasts are registered and growing around 2% monthly. And why wouldn't they? It has got everyone hooked. From true crime aficionados to anyone who is in need of a good chuckle. Or anyone need to find your core with the self-help guides. Podcast is the perfect medium to reach your audience now more than ever. More than 70% podcast listeners have reported to listen either while doing creating podcasts was a challenge, be it in Next, let my colleague to tell you how audio can be used as an audiobook creator. Thank you, Sarah. My name is Jenny. I am going to talk about using audio to convert ebook to audiobook in minutes. Everyone you know is hooked onto the new medium of consuming audiobooks gives the users the advantage of multitasking. Getting an audiobook recorded is an expensive affair, which would cost thousands of dollars and weeks, if at earliest. Starting from finding the right studio, to the voice over artists. 
This is far beyond the reach of self-published or indie writers with limited budget. Audio tackles this problem by converting your existing ebook to audiobook in a few clicks and gets you a public page to share your audiobook. Okay, so I've actually done this, but uh, I do not want to play it you know, until finished because we have many things to, uh, what I call, the, to do. So you can actually download the video here, or actually you can also download the video here as well. So this is the way how to download it. Okay. Uh, as usual, you can also uh, put in your background music if you want, you know, uh, and also do the pronunciation map, you know, teach the I, I how to pronounce certain words. And you click plus, which means you are adding a new session immediately after this, what they call paragraph. Okay, let's see how actually you actually produce this uh, text to video kind of things. This is what I have done. But uh, let's say do a let me do a new video. Okay, you can actually uh, create a title, whatever you want, and what are the sizes that you know you want to do your text to video. So just now we actually do it on a landscape, you know, so that I can post it in LinkedIn, YouTube, Facebook, or Twitter. But you also can do it in uh, portrait, especially if you are doing uh, Instagram, TikTok, or, or you, uh, Facebook stories, you know, or maybe a square one, you know. So these are the three sizes that you can choose. And uh, in between section, uh, which means after the people who have talked certain section, you have to have a fade effect, you can do it. If you do not want, then you don't have to do it. So the subtitle is uh, is good, you know, if you are actually uh, have a, what I call a, audience of uh, different people around the world so that you know you can add the subtitle uh, in your video if you do not want to put a video i mean the subtitle is up to you but then uh, it's up to you because sometimes uh, people can't hear properly if this is uh, not their native language okay so the subtitle could be small medium large or extra large and it can be in the middle top center so this is the default value and the font either three of them which is actually uh, not enough you know, in my opinion they should have a what they call a give us more font but i was uh, talking to the founder they, they are actually in the process of putting more font okay you can preview the font so these are the google font you know actually okay so if you sometimes you look at my video just now uh, there is a subtitle background because my uh, what they call my what they call photos are not very dark in the background so it's best that you know you put a subtitle background if you don't put then it will be very light like this okay so this is something that you know uh to bear in mind okay that's it so this is the video uh that is uh, a video maker which is actually text to video and from here you can see that you know when you create a new video you still have to upload your uh, video, uh, no, your photo. Okay, let's say, for example, we do a test. The size, maybe landscape. Okay, you still have to choose a photo of your own in order to start doing it. If not, uh, you can actually uh, st uh, starting it. So I was uh, talking to the founder. So they actually maybe will. Uh, link in into this uh, what they call uh, free stock photos in the future and this is in their roadmap okay so let's go into our created video here as usual you can actually edit your your video as you want to okay this is the initially this is uh, what i've actually done so we can change the font change the subtitle background if you don't want the subtitle background because this background photo is actually a bit whitish so that's why i put subtitle background so if you don't want to don't have the subtitle you just leave it there okay so it's quite simple let's uh, save this as well okay let's uh maybe i should play this video you know this is made in uh, indian voice uh, rohit and nija <laughs> let's uh do it okay let's uh, preview it so that it uh, 
you can actually preview it means actually after we have actually done all the editing you we can preview the video before you download it take a while but actually it's quite fast you know so every time you after you preview you process it you should download it you know to save a copy okay i have chosen this uh, a sound called rohit and we have two person here one is nija at the end here okay let's wait for a while before we actually uh, get it processed you know this is a uh, not very long you know maybe about three minutes uh, video but then the every time you click process it will actually uh, process it in the server uh, to make a new video out of it okay hopefully this is uh, done first okay it's ready hi my, my name is rohit today, today i am going to talk about what are the use cases of audio a new app which uses AI-powered text-to-speech engines developed by industry leaders like Google, Microsoft and Amazon. Audio is a tool that helps you create video and audio content using human-like voices with the most simplified workflow. First, let me talk about creating a podcast within minutes by using audio. Podcasts is the new buzz all around the town, although it's not that new of a medium, and some would argue they're not new at all. But in the past few years, we've seen them created and downloaded at record rates. A whopping 4.5 million podcasts are registered, and growing around 2% monthly. And why wouldn't they? It has got everyone hooked. From true crime aficionados to anyone who is in need of a good chuckle. Or anyone need to find your core with the self-help guides. Podcast is the perfect medium to reach your audience now more than ever. More than 70% podcast listeners have reported to listen either while doing housework or commuting to work. Creating podcasts was a challenge, be it investing in a recording setup or an individual feeling insecure about their voice. And let's not talk about the hassle of hosting or uploading your content on all major platforms. Audio removes all these hurdles and get your podcasts running up in a few minutes. Next, let my colleague to tell you how audio can be used as an audiobook creator. Thank you, Rohit. My name is Nirja. I am going to talk about using audio to convert ebook to audiobook in minutes. Everyone you know is hooked onto the new medium of consuming a new kind of books, that is audiobooks. Audiobooks gives the users the advantage of multitasking while giving them the benefit of productivity. The audiobook market is expected to grow over $9.3 billion by 2026. Getting an audiobook recorded is an expensive affair, which would cost thousands of dollars and weeks if at earliest. Starting from finding the right studio to the voice over artists. This is far beyond the reach of self-published or indie writers with limited budget. Audio tackles this problem by converting your existing ebook to audiobook in a few clicks and gets you a public page to share your audiobook. My colleague Rohit will continue to cover the last topic, that is creating a voiceover in minutes. Voiceovers are a requirement in almost everyday tasks, be it creating a commercial, IVR or just plain old how-to or onboarding videos. A voiceover artist can cost anywhere from $25 to $250 for every 500 words, and this can take you days to get the required output. Audio makes this process seamless and affordable, provides you with a text-to-speech converter to get your voiceover scripts to voices in a few clicks. Okay, so we have seen that. Let's uh, move back to our, what they call, text-to-video editor here. So you can actually download it if you are satisfied with it, you know. So that's it. This is uh, what I call the way how to do the text to video. And of course, if you want to add in additional scene, you know, you can just click, uh, click here, which means you put in your words. Then you can upload the video or image, you know, a different video or image here. So this is uh, quite uh, straightforward. So after that, you can just play and it's called uh, edit the, the, what I call the video, I uh, know the text to speech uh, intonations. 
Okay, then from here, you can actually change the voice or maybe you want to upload an audio file, it's also can. But then for the purpose of this demo, I'm not going to do it because it will take up a lot of time. Let's uh, delete it now. Okay, delete this section. Okay, that's it. So now you can see that, you know, uh, what I call uh, audio. Uh, this app can actually uh, do voiceover as well as text to a video uh, quite easily. So we will come back to the next session, uh, not next section, next uh, what I call a uh, function. Uh, there is a podcast creator as well as audiobook creator. Okay, let's move on to our review here. Okay, just now we are talking about the first impression, uh, what are the pros you know, of uh, this uh, audio app. And we are talking about these uh, public pages uh, in podcasts and audiobooks. So we can also actually, uh, what they call, uh, achieve, uh, what they call, uh, embed this uh, podcast, uh, voiceover or audiobook in the, using the iframe. Okay, let's see how we do it. To this, for example, the script. Okay. Oh, we are going to do this uh, podcast actually. Okay, so for podcast, uh, many people actually, uh, I mean, have difficulty on how to actually uh, do a podcast. You know, of course, you can actually uh, use your own voice. You know, to, to do a podcast, but then many people are actually shy of their own voice or maybe feel very nervous about their voice. So for using audio. You can actually uh, do a podcast using uh, artificial uh, intelligence, uh, maybe using the robot's voice. But this robot voice could be very uh, near to human voice. Uh, let me show you the, the what they call uh, this uh, demo talk show, uh, which actually I've done it. You know, so but before we actually go into detail how to do the podcast uh, in the editor, let's go into this. Uh, Uh, when my lifetime deal talk show first let's click it here okay this is what i've already done i've actually done the first episode you know very short uh, episode so there are a few uh function here you can actually uh what i call uh let me show you the public pages so this is the public pages uh we are talking about so you can see that you know uh quite nicely done you know basically i just need to edit what i call the caption as a title the description and upload my voice i uh, upload this uh what i call the uh, text to speech uh, voiceover and that's it you know so all these are actually done by audio itself you know this uh, landing page is done by the audio itself so it's not done by me you know so only thing that uh, i have to put in the uh this picture, you know, this uh, squarish uh, uh, photo. So let's play this uh, episode one of my lifetime deal talk show. Okay, let's play now. It's very short, you know. So, but then it's for demo purposes. So this episode we're talking about what is lifetime deal, you know. Let's go. What is what a is lifetime deal? deal? In layman terms, lifetime deals are massive discounts on apps, software, tools, or any resources where you only pay one-time fee to get to use them for life. A SaaS lifetime deal is when a SaaS does a limited-time promotion offering a lifetime access for a certain fixed price. The promotion is normally run in a fixed duration of time. Once you buy and redeem a SaaS lifetime deal, you have access to that software for the lifetime of the product. Obviously not the lifetime of the buyer. Smiley face. <laughs> I purposely put a uh, emoji at the back, you know, I just put smiling face, but so you, you can recognize the smiling face uh, emoji, you can say, oh, smiling face. So, okay. If you want to share this uh, podcast, you can just click this button. Where you actually uh, email to your friends or maybe find more apps you know share with your friend this is something that you know uh, quite uh, neatly done okay so let's go back to the back end so this is the public pages uh public page uh, just now we click here you can see that you know how is this uh uh podcast show is uh, 
all about. And with the RSS feed, you can actually connect it to maybe Google or Apple Podcasts, where every time a new episode is actually uh, added, you know, they will actually connect it to this uh, podcast platform uh, automatically. So publish on podcast app. Let me, let me, I have not done it, but let me try this and see. Okay, so this is the way, okay, this is actually go into the resources. How do you, uh, what they call, uh, publish your podcast in media platform, for example, Spotify, Apple Podcasts, as well as a Google Podcast using RSS link. And bear in mind that these three platforms are the biggest uh, podcast platform in the world. So if you want to distribute, please distribute to all these uh, three platforms. Okay. And for your information, I'm not going to detail on how to actually uh, do the processing in the Spotify or Apple podcast, you know, Google podcast, because uh, that, that involve a registration as well as uh, waiting for them to approve your uh, podcast channel. Okay, so this is the, what I call this, our uh, uh, podcast creator. And you can actually embed your podcast creator inside your website. Use this iframe code, then you can embed it. Very simple. No, just embed it using this code. Okay. Of course, duplicate, you can do it. You know, let's say maybe we want to edit. Okay, as you can see just now, uh, in our, what I call this, a uh, podcast uh, public page. This is the public page. And let's go back to the back end. This is how I, what I call, uh, change the titles, you know, for this first episode and the short description. And the cover image. This is the cover image you have to do yourself and then uh, make it uh, publish it you know so if you are doing explicit content you have to put it here you know, so that you know the reader uh, what they call listener will know that this is uh, explicit content okay publish you click the publish so between it actually will go into the uh, podcast platform okay let's save it okay this is where the back end of this uh, episode so i just uh, as usual, just now we actually go into this, uh, my website, grab this text, put it here, then I use a uh, male voice, uh, Wayne. So Wayne is a Singapore guy, you know, so you can actually use any voice you want, if you want to, okay. And that's it, you know, so it's uh, actually quite simple. So whatever that is inside the video or podcast creator, the, the script create editor is the same. So you have to master the script creator. And for your information, I didn't do any changes into the intonation or whatever, but it's actually look quite uh, uh, human like, you know. So this is how uh, you can actually create a podcast, you know, in a few minutes, you know, actually. So that, that's it, you know. Let's... Uh, move on okay for example you want to do a new show you know this is what i have done but for you want to do a new show let's click it on put your title put your description select a uh, category from here then choose a file that's it you know you just click and your podcast uh, will be published it's very simple okay let's move on to our review page Okay, come to this, uh, what I don't like about this uh, audio, uh, that means what could be improved. I think we will leave it until the end. So let's move back to our backend. The last one is actually audio books. So basically, the audio books is actually convert the text into a uh, audio books, you know. So it's very similar to this uh, uh, podcast maker. Very similar. So let's say you want a new book. You just click a new book. Put your name of the book. The author. Maybe put your name. A description. Choose a file. Click publish. Save. Then your audio book public page is on. <laughs> Let me show you. Okay. This is the my uh, what I call testing uh, public page of this uh, 
audiobook. Okay, so let's click here to see the public page. Yeah, this is the public page. And this uh, image is actually done in one minute, you know, so, but I'm actually not editing anything, you know, just simply grab one photo <laughs> and then put it there. But anyway, I just want to show you that, you know, uh, it's very simple to do. So it's quite similar to this uh, podcast, uh, podcast creator, you know, you have the title, your author uh, of the book, and this is where you play. You can play your audio book. So just play it now. It's actually the same text, you know. What is a lifetime deal? In layman terms, lifetime deals are massive discounts on apps, software, tools, or any resources where you only pay one-time fee to get to use them for life. A SaaS lifetime deal is when a SaaS does a limited-time promotion offering a lifetime access for a certain fixed price. The promotion is normally run in a fixed duration of time. Once you buy and redeem a SaaS lifetime deal, you have access to that software for the lifetime of the product. Obviously not the lifetime of the buyer. Okay, that's it. Let's go back to the back end. Okay. And you can see that, you know, you can have uh, add different chapter. Let's say now this is the first chapter, I call it introduction. You just want to add another chapter. Just put the name, save it. Let me, chapter two. Save it. Then put your text here and create your text uh, voiceover. That's it. Very simple. As long as you know how to use the script creator, uh, editor, this is the same process over again. Okay. That's it, you know. Guys, uh, this is how uh, we can use this uh, audio uh, app uh, to do text voiceover, text to video. Uh, podcast creator as well as the audiobook creator it's quite simple actually you know very simple to use let's move back to our review page yes okay i mean for every app you know we actually have uh, maybe some pros and cons you know so the pros here is actually what we have already said you know you can actually uh read it you know i actually talk about it Right now, for the cons, uh, which is something that I don't like, you know, and this is actually for improvement purpose, you know, for the founders. And basically, this lifetime deal is only have uh, 30,000 words, you know, but then it will reset every month, you know. So let's look at the, the deal plan. So $89, you're going to have uh, 30,000 words per month, you know. So 30,000 words. So if you are run up to maximum, then you have to wait until it reset every month. Okay. Yeah, though the embedding of this voiceover, podcast, audiobook is possible, uh, text to video actually cannot be embedded in the website directly. You know, because you still you have to you have to post it into the Instagram, Facebook, or something like that. You know, but it's not a direct uh, what you call embedding. Okay. So for text to video creation, you need to upload your own images or video at the present moment. But in future, I was told that you know, they will add this uh, some stock photo or some maybe from free site, you know, they can choose your own photos. Okay, and one thing that uh, quite uh, important for me is actually sometimes I want to move around the, what they call the script from between the script creator a video creator, podcast creator, as well as a audio creator. You know, sometimes it's a repeating uh, script. So, but right now I I can't do it uh, uh, easily. You know, I inside the backend. Let me show you what it, what what do you mean by that? Okay, for example, I'm using this one. Uh, use cases of audio. This is the script. For example, I want to. Copy the whole thing into this uh, video, uh, text to video or podcast uh, creator. I can't do it uh, directly, you know, but uh, I hope that they can actually uh, do a direct uh, uh, moving around between these uh, four uh, menus. This is what I mean. Okay, and you can actually cannot 
control the speed of the playback in the available audio player as well as in the podcast or, or audio book uh, public pages. I think sometimes uh, people, even though it's audio book you know, or podcast, sometimes people want to slow down the speed of the playback so that they can hear properly. So that's why uh, this could be a nice uh, features. And for public pages, uh, right now it's actually uh, under their name, under their what they call this, uh, their, their what they call domain name, uh, under audio. I would actually prefer that you know, they can give us a C name for public pages uh, so that we can kind of uh, bracket host it in our website. But actually, it's in their website, but we use the C name. Okay. And customization for the public pages and podcasts. Uh, uh, on audiobook, uh, they, they, there is not much customization that you can do and I just hope that, you know, they can actually uh, let us do some customization. Customization, maybe, um, let me show you, this is the, let's go to the public page first. Okay. For example, uh, when I'm talking about customization, it's like this. I want to change my name here, Albert Tan, but I couldn't change it because, uh, I mean, they don't allow us to change, you know, but this is actually quite, uh, uh, what I call, not annoying because sometimes I have a website, but then I want somebody to actually like, you know, put other people's name, not my name. So I can't do it, that kind of thing. So customization, maybe we can actually uh, do some customization down here uh, for the different episode. Then maybe we want to put some text down there. Maybe the what they call the, the text of this uh, uh, episode in terms of uh, in, because sometimes people want to hear the voices, but sometimes people also want to read the text. So that's where we. I I hope that you know this can be achieved. But then maybe they need some uh, uh, more uh, technical. Uh, uh, challenge to do it, you know, so this is something nice to have, you know, so to change to customize the uh, what you call audio audio book or podcast creator public pages. This is what I mean. Okay, and right now, uh, there's no Chrome extension as usual. Uh, Chrome extension could be useful for people who do a lot of this, uh, what they call a uh, text voiceover. If they want to do it fast, you know, just click the Chrome extension. No need to go into the app itself. So this is what uh, I'm hoping that you know, this will be done. Okay, that's it, guys. Uh, for the use cases, these are the use cases: voiceover creator, voice uh, video creator, podcast creator. These are all uh, extracted from their website, and you can actually uh, look at on their resources page, Facebook group, as well the roadmap. And this is a very important. Uh, comparison you know uh, what are the competitors are doing uh, against uh, audio let's click this okay you can see that you know uh, audio play hd logo and the listener these are the four main player which have been uh, on ltd uh, before you know it's actually uh, play hd logo and listener and what are the differences you know uh, i would say that you know uh, Prices are more or less the same in the monthly prices, but then uh, the quota per month. Uh, this is quota per month for the monthly prices. Okay, so you can compare. So it's also about the same the audio and also listener. And for the free trial, yes, both all of them have a free trial. Okay, for maximum character per conversion is actually unlimited because uh, it's only limited by your uh, credit, okay? So for podcast, uh, I think this is Lowo. Lowo don't have uh, any podcast uh, creator. And the other two for public page, except uh, listener and audio, you can have a public page. The other two you don't have, okay? So, for a podcast show, you can have unlimited podcast show in listener as well as uh, audio, but the others are either one or maybe no podcast support. So the other advantage is actually audio book. Uh, you can do it in audio, but you can't do it in a listener at the present moment. So this is the plus point. 
Okay, emphasis and pause. So this is something like we call it intonation. You better control your pitch and also the speed of the of the what they call the voice. So most of them will have most of them will have this uh, emphasis and uh, pause features. And custom pronunciation that means you teach the AI how to pronounce your word. Or everyone have it. And background audio music. We can actually put audio music to your audio file or also maybe your human voice as an audio file. So for others you don't have, but for audio you can do it. Okay, so for the voices, looks like uh, audio is in the lead now because they have uh, 680 plus voices against uh, the other competitors. And support for different voices in one script, yes, you can do it in uh, audio and some of the competitors you can't. And player analytics, yeah, this is something important, especially if you're audio book as well as a podcast uh, public pages. So this is coming soon, you know, uh, that is very good. Okay, commercial use, yes, everybody can use it, uh, can have it uh, for your commercial use. Okay, folder management, folder management means uh, you can actually uh, organize your, your, what they call your script, you know, uh, in the dashboard. A duplicate item or oh, this is important because sometimes you want to do some changes you just want to duplicate it so upload files for your cartoon audio file in between script like intro outro music or sound effect yeah you can do it here but others competitor you can't and embeddable players uh, most of them can so this is uh, something that you know uh, to look out for so and bear in mind that this comparison table is actually based on this date on, on their website you know uh, this comparison table is done by audio not done by me so you can just have a look okay let's move on and the founder have actually done a text to video called my wife don't get along no it's a creepy story actually it's quite nice you know but you can watch it in their youtube channel okay guys so this is uh how uh this uh, review like and you have any question uh, please put down in what i call in the comment below and hopefully you know uh, if i got i can if i see that will actually help to answer it and if you are in youtube you can actually uh, put your comments you know and let us know what is your comment so and before we end uh just want to say that you know give this uh audio app a trial and you can actually uh what they call go to their website or maybe go to the deal page and check it out so without uh what they call delaying anymore uh this is to say goodbye to everyone that's it let me show my face okay that's all uh guys uh this is my review of this uh audio uh, app and we we'll see you in the next session and thank you for your time as well as uh what i call uh your patience bye bye